so we are back again for another saturday wrap which incidentally is recorded on the friday in bedworth and um when you're probably watching this tomorrow it'll be saturday i will be in newport these are the things if you haven't seen this before um this is me just looking back at the week and moaning about a lot of things and um first of all um i asked for feedback and i had some feedback and it was much appreciated um apparently um in the evening led zeppelin 43 years old 43 years old shows my age and also sometimes it's not just the age of the song it's the it's the memories it's the when you first heard it and it just reminds you of things and sometimes you just see robert plant on youtube and the video for it it wasn't really a video for it but there you go anyway thank you very much for the feedback much appreciated it sort of like that anyway let's get on with the week uh that ends the 27th of january 2020 for the word or phrase of the week storm storm isha and storm jocelyn so up until then it had been very cold freezing and such like and then the wind changed direction to a westerly off the atlantic and we had two lots of a very windy very wet blowiness um and we had a bit of amber as well although we seem to have got away with it a bit in the sunny lower rumley valley although last night wasn't a storm very very blowy uh there you go although the wind now has changed direction to a southerly and we could be getting some saharan sand blowing our way so look out for red sort of sandiness on your cars or windows coming up in the next week anyway it's much milder which is good um the app of the week okay it's a mac os app i was watching screencasts online uh, sort of a tutorial review sort of site darcy hegarty from australia came up with quit all if you just want to quit everything or nearly everything or quite a lot of things with one click this is the thing for you okay you could just close them down manually and all that sort of stuff but i like it I, i'm on the free trial at the moment i'm gonna cough for it um when we get paid next week which i think is good to be perfectly honest but quit all up the thing of the week the thing of the week relates to wednesday where i had an emergency beano uh, which is a day off it was one of those things that i need a day off anyway halfway through the day ended up in the pen and wig was asked if i liked beer and could i taste their bass because they'd had complaints about it of course i could and the first thing i did was ask for a glass of water because i'm a pro and i know you need to cleanse your palate long story short someone had complained about the bass they changed three casks washed all the pipes out changed everything still no joy and here we are it didn't taste like bass it didn't taste like bass that had gone off it was relatively hoppy it tasted like a good beer but what it was i don't know uh, but it certainly wasn't bass so i have a, a feeling that this one will run and run but now i am the bass inspector or something like that and on to music this is up to date this is a value for value music so you can pay for it with your satoshis satoshi's 100th millionth of a bitcoin and i heard it it was the last track that was played on the booster grand ball last saturday morning so it ties in with my well 43 year old track before that and it is and i don't know which right way round it is it's everything by my favorite band or my favorite band playing everything or whatever i can't remember but it's very good and i might actually throw them a couple of sats in fact on saturday morning uh, i reimbursed some of the stuff i had from some of the sites i go to get sats and i've got a lot of sats now i'm going to transfer them over to fountain and boost from there but if you like the music wave lake places like that give them your sats 
which is good because um, these artists get far more than they do from Apple Music, even with special audio and uh, Spotify. So, as I said, Saturday, Saturday was on the change. Saturday was milder than it was wetter. And I spent the early morning in the Malcolm Up Hill and then I went to Brew Monster. And yet again, on a Saturday, Brew Monster was shut. I suspect staffing um, and I suspect they're not doing themselves any favours if they're not open on a Saturday at all. It's a shame, but there you go. Anyway, uh, Sunday, um, more square space in. Uh, I think I now have the fantasy football up there and the old domain, which was this is the way forward, I think has expired and the old hosting has expired. So rwnash.info. That's the only thing I've got left apart from rwnash.blog. Yeah, micro.blog and all that sort of stuff. A Sunday into Monday storm Isha. I've already mentioned that. Not keen to be perfectly honest. And it blew a tree half over in the park opposite work. And they had some highly trained artisans in who cut the rest of the tree down. They were very quick. They were very effective. But they were very expensive though. Um right, um Tuesday. Tuesday, well, Monday into Tuesday, all the Apple updates again. 17.3 on the iOS and iPad OS. Under my TV OS yet, but there you go. Uh, Tuesday night into Wednesday, Storm Jocelyn. Yeah. Um, <laughs> right. I don't know why I put this. Uh, Tuesday, not a new boiler. It'll come back to me, no doubt. Wednesday. An emergency be no, definitely an emergency be no. Ah, and the bus inspector Thursday, Burns night. Yeah, um, in spoons you had Nessie's monster mash beer, which was adequate. Uh, from the King Gone Brewery, which is Scottish, and today, semi spring, sunny and nice. And the wind has dropped and I've got washing out on the line and I still can't remember. And not, oh, yes, I do remember what it is. I had a text from British Gas saying they're coming on the 5th of February, 2nd of February to install my new boiler. Except that was four years ago. So I rang them up. After about four days, they answered, yeah, this is a GDPR thing. Um, I'm not getting a new boiler. They did apologise. But... I'm not surprised. British Gas internally, their engineers, excellent, fine. Their internal systems, not as good. So that was my week. And I've gone way over the five minutes again. Thank you for watching. Comments are very welcome, positive or negative or just neutral. Um, and I'll see you in a week's time, I believe.